We've heard a lot this week about defunding police departments, a popular rally cry at protest events. But in Dallas, the police department is millions of dollars over its current budget, and the city is trying to make some, some of that gap. Today, the city council delayed moving forward with its items in the police department's budget after debating the defunding topic. Fox Force Lynn Ann Wynn has a closer look at today's city council meeting. Lynn Ann. Steve, the calls to defund the police department come as the city of Dallas is trying to balance its budget. Dallas officials say the police department is currently six and a half million dollars over budget with almost 100 unbudgeted police officers that still need to be paid. But city council members are at odds with how to move forward with police funding. Don't shoot! As public cries to defund police departments grow louder across the country, the city of Dallas is trying to balance its budget, including funding for Dallas police. According to city employees, DPD has used $20 million of its overtime budget for the year and estimate they racked up about $1.5 million in unexpected costs to staff just the first week of recent protests. There are other costs that need to be paid too, like the 97 officers they hired above what they planned for. Um, we have to address uh, public safety in a way that we haven't before, which is going to be um, looking at where we are able to impact public safety, uh, maybe from some budget items that wouldn't have normally been umbrellaed under public safety. Despite these costs, some city council members are asking to rethink how the city funds the police department and take a look at other ways city funding can be used. Nobody is saying that we don't need police officers because we do. I back the blue as much as anybody else. However, there are also things that we can consider that's going to allow us to move funding into other areas to address some of these mental health concerns and other concerns and provide resources in the communities. But others expressed concern that they were bowing to recent public pressure to defund the police department. The increase to police funding is to pay for new police officers we were able to recruit and existing officers we were able to retain. The council members have been briefed about this issue and not one person objected. You know, there's just a lot of um, kowtowing to 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 pressure that people seem to be getting. And the reality is we're on the right track. We are addressing poverty issues. We're addressing it through our budget today. Ultimately, council voting to delay changes to DPD's budget and take a closer look at how the money is spent. There's a lot of moving parts and people reacting out of emotion and we're, we need to kind of take time to take a, a step back so we can do the right thing. And City Council will revisit this issue. They're expected to vote on it no later than August. They typically finalize the city's budget in September.